Now I'm going to share with you about one thing that is very essential for you to have eternal life. And this is what Christ is telling um, in his words found in Matthew chapter 5 verse 20. He says, except your righteousness will not exceed to the righteousness of the Pharisees and the scribes, ye shall in no case enter into the kingdom of God. What did Christ say? To the people, he said that we must exceed the righteousness of the, the scribes and the Pharisees as well in order for us to enter into the kingdom of God. Then how can we exceed the righteousness of the Pharisees and of the scribes? While they regarded themselves as very righteous of their own. How can we do that? How can we exceed the righteousness of Christ or the righteousness of the Pharisees and the scribes? Well, we have one thing we need to know. It is only the righteousness of Christ. We cannot do anything by exceeding it through our own obedience of the commandments as what the Pharisees and the scribes did. But if we have the righteousness of Christ in our lives that he offered to us in free, we can have the eternal life. We hope that uh, this very short Bible information about the righteousness of Jesus, he wants us to accept this righteousness he offered us for free and he wanted us to call by this name according to Jeremiah 23 verse 6, the Lord our righteousness.